Greetings, YouTube. Happy Wednesday. It is new content day. Can you believe it? New content day. That is so exciting because it means that the gifting month, the banquet month, kind of can start. Now, the patch was out on Monday, and we did have several things to get excited about. If you haven't seen it, if you haven't done it yourself, you can now sell Tier 4 Class Catalyst and Tier 5 Basic and Tier 2 Alpha and some of the other things that were previously too quote-unquote high-valued item to sell. Okay, so we have a party foul. The holidays can be rough. So we've got the event quest that, yes, is eligible for Time Attack Legends, although if you got a six-star Hercules um, and the opportunity presents itself, and I, as somebody who got the Legends title from Incursions through Sector, I, it's by far the easiest way to go. I'm not saying you can do it itemless because it depends on also luck of the draw in some ways, but uh, yeah. And then we got Check Your Letters from Champion Solo Objective... And the holidays will have you seeing red to go to the side quest. And that requires bundle of letters to enter the quest, which are given out through weekly objectives. And this week, we have letters from champions week one, when a fight with or against a champion who asked for a new camera lens for the holidays, when a fight with a hero tag champion or defeat a villain. Uh, and that really pretty amazing gold. I mean, this is the kind of gold that Kabam would have charged 50 bucks for even last year. Now, of course, that's with other things. But um, the gold then has a Tier 5 Class Catalyst Selector. I'm never a fan of the Crystal versus the Selector, but better than nothing. Get three of those. And then, ooh... Fully formed Tier 3 Alpha Catalyst. Yes, please. I will absolutely take that. And then the villain side of things, I'm guessing maybe Tier 5 Basic. But that's, between both of those, that's over a million gold. That's uh, really, what, over 2 million gold? And there's the Tier 6 Basic. That's fantastic. And if you're somebody who does the arena regularly like me, I'm not saying you should want to do that because you should value your sanity more than I do. Um, you're just naturally going to clear these off just doing fights like normal. But that's that's a huge gift. The, the side quest rewards are a huge gift to players in the gifting month because so many people, and I've covered this on the channel, are gold and ISO poor. Now, this doesn't solve the ISO problem necessarily, but it helps the gold problem. I'm not saying this is the only way to help the gold problem. Kabam doesn't want it to be because, of course, naturally... If you solve the gold problem, then you're not as motivated to buy 300 unit apiece greater gifting crystals or greater banquet crystals or whatever they're calling that this year. And then we have bonuses that are five star relic uh, crystal shards, generic six star six stones, and you just kind of go back and forth on one or other of those. Keep in mind that the generics are so much easier to get now. Uh, once you become Valiant, I know that's far off for many people watching this, but uh, the test of the Valiant becomes that. And then, yes, we're back to the Thronebreaker event quest exploration gauntlet ticket. I am so impressed with Kabam's generosity for free gold because in past years they would really capitalize on the high demand and low supply of the gold market and make it essentially a way to be profitable. And I'm, I'm sure they'll try to come out with, say, the golden piggy bank or other cash slash unit-based opportunities for gold. And that's fine. They're, they're a for-profit company. They should want to do that. I also have to say, I really don't miss that new store layout that I was not a fan of. The old store, it's just it's one of those things like if it's not broken, don't fix it. And I wonder if one of the reasons why we switched back to the horizontal versus the vertical store is because they thought they would get a whole bunch of new sales from people who were just so tempted to see the new limited offers and click away from it. But uh, I don't know. Right now, it's uh, it's real exciting. I also feel like that Cosmic Ghost Rider profile pick is calling my name. I'm going to have to buy that at some point. Depends how much wine I've had in me one night. And by wine, of course, I mean 
negative comments underneath videos that are whining. <laughs> Either way, uh, Kabam, amazing gift to start out this month. Two million gold for free? That's going to help a lot of people, and they're very easy tasks to get that gold. So I love when I can support Kabam because it's pro player and pro Kabam. In this case, it's actually much more pro player than pro Kabam because, of course, uh, that is something that is um, really a huge benefit of today. So thanks for watching. Have a good one. Kabam, way to go. I love the start of this month. You get two big thumbs up for me on this one.